Uh, good morning. Uh, nice to see you all again. And welcome you here in Israel. Mekal, Mekal, Tel Aviv University. And, and after last night, I'm very glad that you all made it. <laughs> and arrived on time. On time. On time and, uh, uh, hope the weather will be a lot better than yesterday. And, and, and your, the rest of your trip here in Israel will be uh, successful. We are very happy to have you here. Um, and I think all three institutes, the Israel Institute, Ono, and Levinsky, and of course, Mental, we are very happy and excited to have you here. So the two success days, and we hope that the last one will be uh, as well. Um, we are usually when we're now, uh, having partners from different projects here in Israel, we'd like to have a kind of a conference to share the knowledge and understand uh, how we can use that and uh, promote the activity between the Israeli partners and, of course, uh, uh, other partners uh, that are involved in this kind of project. And there is a good example that we have here. Um, Part of it, of course, Georgia partners, and we'll see in a little bit about it. And of course, all the European partners, uh, Porto, uh, of course, uh, in Madrid, sorry, Barcelona, uh, and, and we have some partners uh, abroad that will share us with, uh, share their experience and so on. So it's very, uh, it's very nice to have you here. Um, I will say a few words about Metal. Most of you already know about Metal, but I think it's a very unique organization that maybe we can uh, see how we can use our um, activity here in Israel to promote the project and promote some other ideas in the future and to see how to work together. Uh, Metallics uh, has a very uh, interesting role or uh, interesting role in the higher education institute here in Israel. It's part um, of the uh, it's part of IUCC. It's uh, what you call in Europe the NRANS, uh, IOCC, it's Inter University Communication Center. Usually it deals with the networks, some uh, very technical aspects, but METAL is one of the units that is really dealing with learning technology. And we are, uh, as we said, part of this NRAN. And this is a very unique uh, for us here in Israel. Uh, and, but I think it's, uh, it's, it's, it's getting more and more uh, options, or it's getting more. There is a lot of other options uh, in, in, the, uh, in Europe, like METAL, but we are dealing with learning technology and promote it as part of the University Communication Center. Mm -hmm. um, we have uh, all, all eight, nine universities involved in METAL, but and, and, and another 25 colleges at the time, mm -hmm. more than uh, 20 now, but involved in metal activity and, and share knowledge and information between them. And we are trying our main activities and my main goal is to uh, assist institutes you know, of higher education, universities and academic colleges to use learning technologies. And we of course learn that learning technologies doesn't come by itself, it usually comes with the pedagogical needs, pedagogical aspects, and, and we try to combine them and see how technology support teaching and learning. And this is something that we are doing before the COVID, almost 20 years uh, after the COVID, uh, during the COVID, of course, after we'll see. Um, and we are doing that for a long time. During the COVID, we, we had a, a very unique and important role in the higher education in Israel. We try to support uh, institute. We were, we were involved in a lot of activity and we are trying to continue this activity for the next phase of the um, uh, COVID and how institutes are using the technology in their activity. So, so um, Mekal is involved in that and we, we are mostly active in the, in the communities and learning technologies and I mentioned that. As you can see, this is our, um, let's say our <clears throat> main activity. We have, um, a large community. I think this is the most important issue that Metal uh, has you know, in, in their uh, in our role in their education. We have a big community that we are working with, uh, kind of uh, um, partners in all higher education institutes, 
they are involved in our activity, they are shared, they are know their knowledge, they are uh, developed together, think together. And you can see some of the examples here uh, with the two institutes, Ono and Levinsky, but it's happened with all others uh, institutes in Israel. And this is a very unique and important thing to share knowledge and share experience and, and to develop together. And we have a lot of work to do in this area, but it's still a good start and there is a lot of uh, around it. Uh, and, and, and of course, the learning technology, that is, that is what we're talking. So we're having a large, um, more than 30 technologies that support teaching that make that offer to universities and academics and support them with that. And they can use, usually it's, it can be the Moodle platform support, it can be the video, it can be, um, it can be uh, plagiarism, any kinds of technology that can support it. And of course, of course, in the last year, we understand that there is a lot of needs to interaction tools like a multimeter, like Club, like others that can um, support their online learning and teaching and they have the, and help the institute and students to be involved in any kinds of uh, interaction activities. And of course, we have uh, some other activities like a research center that we are uh, having in, uh, in Mekal, a small group of people, uh, along as part of this group, and some other partners from other institutes, Tel Aviv University and other, uh, that are sharing. We have a very nice book that will be published in the new group this time, in a few weeks, we hope, two or three weeks. It's already ready with uh, some knowledge and information in the Hebrew. And of course, the infrastructure and everything, I'm not going to get into that. So <clears throat> another uh, aspect that may tell is very important is uh, it's, it's, uh, the, the, the working group. And it uh, it's, uh, it's depends and change every time, but at this time we have the new technologies group that we are sharing, find and try to find more technology that we find. Online courses and e-learning uh, spaces. The Moodle is one of them, but it can be any other LMS that uh, we're trying to figure out what will be the next phase, like Discord, like uh, Gedgely or other uh, options. The video and multimedia, technopedagogical aspect. This is a very important issue because this is the co connection and the collaboration between technology and pedagogical needs. So this is something that we are trying to focus on and see how, how technology supports pedagogical aspects. Uh, and research and sophisticated. Right. So, so this is um, in general what Mital is um, is doing, and uh, and of course we we already start discussing with Wilbert and others to see how we can um, uh, share knowledge and, and 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 maybe collaborate in the future. Of course, we would like to do this with all of, all of you uh, because of the special role of Mital in the higher education, and I think it's a, it's a good chance to have that. In, in the future. And you're all familiar with Metal Conference. The next one will be in a few months. And we'd like to uh, keep the traditional uh, uh, session that we have on love distance in our conference. And I think it will uh, 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 contribute to the conference. Um, I think that's all about Metal. Um, and now I'd like to um, 